Let him in the gloom and revive. The great Excuse me? Who once ruled this earth as the medium between the human world and the demon world. Is this magnificent view? The greatest minds of their time, those who revered evil, constructed this glorious edifice. Now, after two millenniums of confinement, it can at last fulfill the purpose for which it was intended. That's none of my concern. Give him the habit. Of course. Of course. Why Virgil hates Dante is just because Dante's mom saved Dante and not Virgil because she couldn't find Virgil when they were all getting attacked by demons. He's still holding that drug. Yeah, and he's still mad about it. Like when they were kids. He's like, why didn't mom ever save me? It's because she couldn't, like, she was literally screaming looking for him but couldn't find him. It's not her fault, she was just a human. <laughs> also, Virgil just fucked that guy. Right. With one hit. He's got a book. What book is that? Dante's Inferno. <laughs> I found it. Why they gotta be so creepy? Cause they're bad guys. Or is it because it's the third mission? Mm, well, I have no, no idea. Know. No one will ever know. This mission. There's not one more fight. Let's see. There's a cool trick to this part. See, these guys, they come down. These guys suck dick. But there's a cool trick to these guys. You mm. see. It's a really big brain play, okay? You just, uh... Run right past them, and you go in here. You just didn't fight anybody? Yeah. Just run past them. Those guys suck. I never fight them. <laughs> <laughs> That's where the shotgun's supposed to be, but we already have it. So now we can just wreck this place up and get all the free money. You can break, like, everything in this bar. When I was a kid, I used to farm this bar to get money. Just because there's what so much money in this bar. Is that it's like blood orbs or something. That's what the yeah. <laughs> oh, shit. Yeah. yeah. If you go up to doors that can't be closed or it can't be opened, a hand will try to grab you. And it'll do damage. So rude. When you see this, it just means you have to do a combo on it. Some of them have like a certain combo specifications, some of them just need you to hit them a bunch of times. Mm. Like some of them need you to get a certain style level of combo. You know like the style bar down the mm. side. <sighs> this is why I don't like this game. Okay, so this introduces... Oh, look, <laughs> I can do this. Wait, why isn't he doing it? I can swing on this pipe. You can hold it? Yeah. I don't know how to do it. There we go. Isn't that epic? Yeah, there's about to be a fight. Okay, so these guys, they can, like, disappear and reappear. Really cool enemy type. I love it when games do that. These guys. See? Oh, nice. I'm just gonna pop Devil Trigger and go aim on them, uh, if you don't mind. You can also roll while targeting by pressing a direction and X. I just come up the fuck out of this guy.
because I'm jumping around like a monkey. They can't hit you when you're all over. I just keep stingering this guy. I did better than I usually do in that fight. Maybe I got good at this game. Oh, here's the like shotgun cancel thing. You can just go. It's so hard to do. Yeah, I did it just then. You gotta press them at near the same time. I'm not gonna be able to do it, I'm just gonna look stupid. I was doing it for a second, there it is. There it is. I got really good at that for a while, so I could just like show off the gun. There's life up here. I don't think I need it though. Um, this is the way out. Switch to the handguns. I think it's smooth sailing from here, if I remember right. I think it's just the boss fight now. All these orbs. There's also some orbs in here. Oh, I guess they take them out if you replay the level. These are like checkpoints. You can buy stuff here. You can. It's pretty much a save point in game. You can continue from here. You can also level up your skills from here. I see, I see. This is not a cool boss fight. It's the ice cup. No, I like this boss fight, but it's kind of a pain. I don't like the ice part of it. <laughs> kinda. Could you get a crappy stone lock thing with the ice? It doesn't freeze you per se, but it puts you in more stun than most stuff does. He's a dog. <laughs> Three of them. I guess he would be a dog. <laughs> so. I remember how to do this. So you gotta shoot the ice off their heads, and then you can hit the skin with your sword for big damage. God damn it. Still got one hit with ice on it. He's not doing anything. I'm afraid of him doing things, but for some reason he's not doing anything. Oh. He was charging uh, ice right there. Oh. God damn it. I'm gonna leave some of this. Got it. Oh no, he's gonna. He just re iced.
Yeah. <laughs> Told you I wasn't gonna do this for sure. This boss isn't easy. Come on, devil trigger. Frog's turn to try Cerberus. Probably die. <laughs> I like how we saw both of his fucking necks. <laughs> Chopped off necks. Oh, and we're doing this no healing potions, obviously. Because we're just replaying this. Oh. So we're forcing ourselves to use no healing potions. You get potions? If you play it, like, real? Yeah. We could use them right now, technically. But we'd be wasting them for our long run. Um, so we're not going to do that. I see you. We're gonna need them later for missions that I haven't already beat. That are actually hard. And this doesn't seem easy. It's the second mission. Yeah. Th this is like a barrier to entry. You gotta get over this. It's like the first real hard boss. Forces you to learn the jumping gun mechanic. This boss fight. Because if you didn't do that, good luck beating this boss. I bet you could, but like... There you go. You're getting some damage in. When he's low like that, you can just swing. You could just keep going. See? I took too long in neutral. Look at him. He's like half dead now. Oh my god. Well... You got the easy mode version. I just want to call it down. Apparently I made it too hard for myself. Well, fine, you can you just kill me for free, no problem. <laughs> it doesn't bother me. Don't forget you have double trigger too. You just keep spamming the language. You're shooting. We're targeting at least. Oh, I forgot I could target him. Please finish him. Shoot him. Shoot him. Shoot him. Shoot him. Shoot him. There you go. You did it. Who knows? I'm not even sure myself. Regardless, you have proved your strength. I acknowledge your ability. Take my soul and go forth. You have my blessing. Jesus' soul. Yeah, but look what his soul is. So this game is like Mega Man in a way. You get a weapon from each boss. Oh, cool. That's all the weapons we have already. That's why we have those swords and shit. Agni and Rudra are a boss. Please get some nunchucks. <clears throat> Three nunchucks. Oh. <laughs> I like the nunchucks actually. But I like Agnes a little bit more, I think. The nunchucks, you can do like a jump swing in the air. It's kind of like a nair, if that makes sense. Mm. It just sweeps the ground. With the uh, nunchuck into the air. I forgot about this part. You're gonna love this. Who that? You'll find out. Her name is literally Lady. It's Lady. What's that? Didn't you get an invitation? Matrix, baby. And he jumped on it. <laughs> we're still that awesome guy we were from mission one. 
where we can jump on the rockets as they're coming at us. She's got two different color eyes. He was so confident in that. <laughs> this just keeps getting better and better. Cutscene. Is the guy reading his copy of the Divine Comedy? Looks like we have an uninvited guest. Is that so? A human. A woman. I'm afraid I should ask the uninvited one to leave. That is what. He has cool guy skin. Oh. So how are we gonna end these things for this? What things? Like how much our outro gonna be for this video? Skip <laughs> up on it! You gonna say that? <laughs> yep. You say that and then it'll cut right after that. <laughs> yep. Perfect.